guys, so I'm going to make a video here. Um, I've seen a lot of people on Windows 10 or anything older than obviously Windows 95. People have been having problems playing uh, Lego Rock Raiders. Um, I had trouble, the, the same trouble, because I've like, tried like so many different times. Didn't work, um, but there is luckily a fix for it. So you'll need to basically have the game. If not, you can go to the website. I'll have it linked in the description below. Um, MyAbandonware.com, Lego Rock Raiders, you can download it. Um, and then at the bottom here, you can also get the no CD fix if you don't have a CD, um, as well as 64-bit setup and manual even if you want to. So once you basically download that and have it set up, uh, you'll want to also go down to this website here. I'll have the link in below. Um, and you download this patch, and basically it has uh, Voodoo 2 in it. So it's basically, it uses this graphics instead. So then you can actually change it. You won't be able to go greater than the screen mode, but at least like you'll get it to work. Um, so I'll show you. Where's my file? So once you kind of extract everything and put it in your download file, so most like you'll go to your programs file, Lego Media Games, Lego Rock Raiders click on that you want to open the application so once you extract everything into voodoo uh, and then you open it up and you can change settings you can kind of just leave it if you want um, it doesn't really do anything like you can add more onboard RAM or VRAM but like for obviously these games it doesn't really matter so for that you can basically just hit apply so you want to obviously for it to actually uh, uh, register it and then you want to click on the CL Gen, and it says it's default, but I just click Voodoo 2 before and hit OK, and then you run Lego Rock Raider, and then it should show you this, and it says Voodoo here, and you can run in full screen uh, window, but I just do full screen, and then it'll actually put the whole screen into full screen instead of just like you know showing up as like a fucking 640 by 8. 100 or whatever the heck it is so it's definitely a lot easier and as you can see in a moment here it'll work I'm just gonna play the same game so yeah as you see I've been playing for a bit here and just to show you it actually works when you play a level and a good thing here is it's pretty responsive. Sometimes I find it can be kind of a bit laggy, but I had it before when I was able to do it without the, the whole voodoo setup. And I could get into here, but anytime I moved my cursor around this area, it would start glitching out. And you could just see just images of the cursor, and it would just start floating all along the borders, and then it would basically just be non playable. But with this, you can obviously see it works pretty well. Now there might be other people who've gotten it to work with, you know, a higher resolution, but I haven't gotten that here yet. And if you can find those videos or how to do it, then by all means go for it. But at least this will um, do the trick in the meantime. So thank you very much, guys, and uh, have a good one.